Hey guys. We got a boat. So yeah, we got the boat and Marissa is going to take us for a tour through it. And yeah, and so is Jack apparently. Yes, Jack is coming. So this is our boat. What is she? Uh, I don't know. She's a 1981 S2 9.2 center cockpit. That's what she yes, is. Yes, that's what she is. Okay. So anyway, so uh, we're in Jersey, and this is where we'll be leaving from in a week or two, hopefully. And yeah, Danforth, roller furling, and yeah. So she's a center cockpit, unlike a lot, if not most, sailboats, which are usually cockpit is at the back. She's in the middle of the boat, which gives us a little bit more room um, berth-wise for where we sleep. And you sit a little bit higher, so when you're navigating, you can see uh, over the everything. Um, we've got a nice that we can use instead of a tiller. It's taking both of us a little get uh, getting used to because we're so used to doing opposite to till and then with the wheel you have to spin it like a car and I don't understand that. <laughs> um, cup holders, she's got a lot of navigational stuff. So we have uh, tactic, uh, wind direction, speed. This cover fits like super tight on here, but it's at least I ain't gonna lose it. So that's her, and actually it's blowing like crazy right now. If it'll pop up. And they're wireless, which is super cool. So actually you can take them down below. Uh, they pop out of those holders there. And yep, so there's direction right now. Sending us right at the bow, kind of blowing us around. Same 13, 14 knots, but we are inland right now, so. Anyways, so that's that. And then over here, uh, that is depth and speed over ground uh, is right there. And then we also have the Garmin uh, 547 uh, right there. That uh, is nice. I've got to get a mount here uh, for the pedestal here. Uh, and I'm going to put our, uh, we have a tablet? Uh, tablet, Samsung tablet, thank you, which I run Navionics on. So we're going to run that there too. Um, super nice compass also, which is pretty awesome. So, all right. Anyways, that's, I'll, I'll talk technical all too, too long. So let's uh, get with, oh, wire before you. Traveler right here to the aft of the helm state, which is fantastic. And swim ladder uh, right there. Magma grill and life sling. Um, little storage down here for winches and what have you, or winch handles, I guess. Um, we have a cool table here that I'm in love with because it folds away or you want to fold some stuff down here and perfect. Here's a fun fact. A pizza box fits perfectly right here. <laughs> no. And if you don't need it, it's gone. Okay, so I'll take you down under into the inside. Down under. Some Aussie is going to beat us up over that one. So we have stairs that are a little bit steeper now. Uh, Jack struggles to get in and out of the boat. It is a struggle for us because we have to pick him up both times. <laughs> um, 
mast pole. Is that what it's called? Mast pole. Right. <laughs> Step, but yeah. Um. So this is Pression our. Pressure post, to be exact. Nobody cares. This is our salon living room, whatever you want to call salon, it. Salon. Yep. Slash, uh, dinette, slash kitchen, but. We'll get there to the yeah. galley. So. We have two settees. This is my settee. This is Josh's. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, for those who aren't seeing what's happening here, there is a five foot settee over here and a six foot settee this over is here. Not even five foot. Yeah. My legs are not five feet long. Otherwise, I would be an anomaly. So, so anyways, she keeps on trying to take the bigger of the two. So we have our little dining table here, if you can see around the mast. Uh, it has nice cup holders, which is great because we knock a lot of things over and it's hard to knock stuff over. <laughs> Be a little more violent. <laughs> uh, we have a table here. Yeah. I don't know how it works yet. Oh, it has a little thing. Yeah, a little thing comes out. Did there you go. Know yep, I did. Hmm. Hmm. Anyways. Yeah, that's actually very steady. I haven't had the table out yet. <laughs> um, there's some storage down below the table. It's magazine storage. Magazine. This is where you would keep your magazines. Or, you know, maybe Whatever like this is. charts. I don't know what that is. I know, I'd have to go through it. I haven't gone through everything. We have a tiltometer. Um, so it's old angled, uh, heel, heel gauge is, is what I call them, but yeah, tiltometer, sure. Um, I'm not exactly a hundred percent why there's two of them there, but this you know. one doesn't, you have to like force that one to do yeah. stuff. That one doesn't work, but this one is very tiltometer-y. <laughs> um, we have a cool clock. It actually works. You have to wind it. Yeah. You can put a bell on it, but I'm not trying to do that. We um, haven't, uh got a barometer yet that's the only thing that we need and then these lights are throughout the cabin and they're my favorite thing because they're like the original um fixtures from the 80s but he outfitted them with led and they're phenomenal because they're great like throwback but they're not throwback they're original yeah and um, they're in fan they're again fantastic shape right and then there's more portholes, and then we have just regular windows with um, slidey curtains, which is nice. Uh, what else? We have storage like everywhere. Some over here. There's some right there. More in here. Um, storage oh, yeah. behind the seats, underneath the settees. Um, and then underneath here, the V-berth, there's storage. Yeah, there's some smaller storage here underneath the V-berth. Excuse my finger there for a moment. Um, so that's the water pump. The, the majority of the V-berth, however, is water tank. So there's 35 gallons of water available. I mean, Plus, that's not water. Yeah. <laughs> Plus... Um, uh, and let me make sure that's fresh water. Uh, plus there is, right now, this is just turned into the collect all storage. of everything storage until we get it all sorted out. So, um, but yeah, yeah. So that would be the berth uh, where we used to sleep on our old boat. Yeah. Oh, we have a, I didn't see that before. Yeah, that's where the plugs are for the, anyways. Um, so, little TV. This is the entrance, remember where we are. We midship. Have, what? Midship. We're at yeah. Just Anyways. Uh, we have a head right here. Um, both of us can't fit in there right now. Um, but we have sink, some storage. We have a little cassette, porta pot e, and a cute little tub. Let me climb in there for. Oh lord. So, I mean, it's not exactly a soaking tub, but it gets the job done, especially if this is all you have, like you're anchored somewhere. Um, yeah, you have your little shower head that we're probably gonna change out. You can pull your shower curtain around so you're not soaking everything. So it's not a wet head. 
Just nice. Yeah, but super nice. You can't exactly have a spa day in here. Oh, well, you can stretch your feet out a little more. I mean, you're <laughs> like that. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's it's pretty nice. It's a lot bigger than what we did have. Uh, yeah, by a mile. Because we have you know a tub and a sink now. <laughs> Kitchen, kitchen thing. Kitchen, yeah. Or galley, really. Galley it. Um, so we have our stovetop here. Alcohol. Alcohol stovetop, which I am not familiar with, but um, right now it has this cutting board on it, and then you can lift it up and put it back there, or you can just slide it anywhere so you don't burn things down. Um, two ranges. Is it gimbaled? No, it's not. Um, it no, used it's to be not. Gimbled. It used to they be. They had gimbled. another one that was gimbled. Yeah, yeah, that's something oh. I need to work on. Uh, so much storage. We have a huge drawer there. Huge. Well, it's not as huge, but it's huge. Um, access to the sink and storage. And we have two slidey cabinets here, which we can definitely make better use of than just that we can get shelves to put across snacks yeah that's it, these are like the key things that we need dentist sticks tennis balls and snacks um and then we have like a cold storage thing ice box if you will uh they put some nice um insulation insulation that's the word thermo paper in there so to keep stuff cold they said it worked really well uh, we have our little power outlet across here and then um, for you know shore power not maybe cruising or anchoring we have a microwave and we have a fridge which is awesome um, at some point we might get rid of the microwave and put a taller fridge here that way we have actually some kind of freezer yeah or like an angle unit one of them angles yeah. that, that run off DC instead of shore power and right. doesn't take any amperage. Right. Yeah, that's um, kind of where we're at. And then on this side of our little hallway here, we have our nav station, which has a radio, like polling radio. Mm -hmm. And then our VHF. Whatever. Our <laughs> other radio has a CD player. Uh, AM, FM, stuff like that. Um, all of our switches that I'm not sure what they do. This is our 12 volt panel. And then we have our shore panel back there. So, in this corner, we have our motor. This is... Motor. Yeah. This is where all that happened. This is uh, Yanmar two-cylinder diesel. Uh, I think it's for around 16, 18 horsepower. Um, anyhow, this pops off, it just pops off, and I'll show you some of this here. So, there's our motor, our fuel tank, uh, aluminum fuel tank, and of course, all our major systems. Uh, and then on back through here, actually, here's another panel to get a hold of them. So, with, um, and it's all in fair shape. There are some things I want to take care of, but nothing major yet. Everything seems to be in pretty good shape. They have just uh, done quite a bit of work to it. So, um, anyhow, so yeah, uh, with this table off, uh, the, the tabletop, which just slides off, it, it does uh, allow a ton of access to the motor. Uh, I know some people say, oh, the access is kind of, crappy on a center cockpit but if you worked on I don't know a, a car newer than 2000 this access is fantastic so um, but yeah it's it's a it, I like it I love it and took it out smooth running they just dumped uh, the previous owner just dumped I don't know like six or seven grand into the motor another six or seven grand into the hull of this boat it's it's in great shape so um, but yeah, so that's it. I'm, I, I can go over more stuff later on if you guys ever want to know more. So, um, we have 
hanging lockers here. Mm -hmm. Closets. Um, it's a good bit of storage. There's plenty of like hanging space. And then just another access point there. Some more hanging. Yeah. And we have our berth, our bed. It looks a little tight back here, like width-wise for the bed, but it's actually a ton of room because we slept here last night and I don't remember touching you at all. <laughs> Not you, the viewer. I mean, I didn't touch you. <laughs> I didn't touch Josh. Yeah. And it's very plush because they, like it has- Memory foam. Memory foam. like. It's, uh, don't worry about it. There's I don't just wanna... the regular pad from here to here, like that you would just buy the boat with. And then from here to here is just foam that they put in. And it's fantastic. Like I, I fell asleep last night and I don't remember anything until this morning. And I didn't even drink. Um, but there's more lights, more port, port, port holes. We have plenty of port holes in here and I love it because yeah. there's so much light access out there you can probably hear jack whining um yeah but here's jack bed there's a little step there yeah um it's, it's supposed to be like a settee for like getting ready i guess but i'm kind of making it jack bed um we have some storage cubbies down here nice shelf mm -hmm. um more locker space back there yeah right locker now it's space, full of tools tools and Ceilings like, and stuff. Yeah. Um, we have a tablet thing holder. Here. Yeah, I guess if you wanted to do work on the tablet or whatever. Or like you wanted to watch TV or something before bed. Um, and then yeah. behind these pillows, we have access, not access, cubbies that are super great because it looks like it just stops here, but my arm can go down and there's so much space for activities. <laughs> Also, beneath the bed is everything from this height here, which, you know, uh, is probably right around two and a half, three, uh, two and a half feet, uh, is absolutely all storage also, mm -hmm. and access to uh, the quadrant. So, um, that's kind of, kind of awesome also for uh, things that we don't need every day. But yeah. But um, yeah, that's our boat. Like, it's not huge by any standard but it's a lot bigger than we used to have and it's gonna suit us for what we want to do which is live on it <laughs> well yeah we're gonna be doing some living and some light cruising here so yeah if you haven't noticed the <laughs> it is it's not exactly standing height right here yeah yeah I'm not uncomfortable <laughs> this is just my height <laughs> so anyhow that's the boat that's where we're at, uh, and that's where we will be. So look us up, find us. Uh, what's the, what do you say at the end of videos? Oh, like, subscribe. Like, what is it? Like, comment, subscribe. There's like a un. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Something like that. Just check us out. All right, guys. If you have any questions? By all means, please put them down below, uh, and I will do my best to answer any that you may have and, and if uh, you have any questions for me i will answer them to the best of my ability but that's probably not gonna be that great for you <laughs> so anyways guys good talking to you talk to you later bye love you bye